um, the promise of the jobs that would come in uh, forced a lot of cities to, uh, you know, really dole out enormous uh, offers of tax giveaways to the company. Now, ordinarily, in response to that, you might imagine uh, your city wanting a community benefits agreement where the hires were, you know, required to be from particularly vulnerable um, and uh, unemployed groups like black and brown communities. But with Amazon's power to essentially set the debate, to set the terms of the interaction with their size, who would challenge them? Who would do such a thing? We, of course, had some brave examples, but the majority of folks were afraid to do so because Amazon had the ability to walk away from the table. and There's no other entity like them. And that's the power of an outsized monopoly. It's the power to totally set the terms of the interaction. So instead of a community benefits agreement, we see a company that abuses its workers of color in its warehouses, um, in its management position has uh, a totally uh, unreasonable level of, of white workers in management positions. And this, this is one of the ways that monopolies help to perpetuate poor racial justice outcomes in this, in this country. Um, there's very little competitive threat or seemingly reasonable power to challenge them. And you know, it's not just in hiring or their competition to, uh, for a place to build their second headquarters. Amazon's expansion plans harm communities of color who in need of jobs are left in a tough position of whether they want to take uh, the environmental risk um, or get rid of the environmental risk or take the jobs. And small businesses where you know, they're more likely to be black owners and black directors in small businesses, how can you compete with a company that controls the majority of all marketplace sales. The truth is right now, you can't. You either have to play their game, uh, letting them extract money from you over and over again if you follow their rules and even more if you don't, or you get swallowed up. Um, and those are the two choices that, that black folks are, are, are offered.